Welcome into another Go Mustang Sports.com Minute with uh, women's ice hockey head coach Tracy Johnson following a 3 nothing loss to the number two ranked Elmira Soaring Eagles. Coach, I have to imagine that's about as good as you're going to feel following a loss, but your girls really gutted out and played hard tonight. They played unbelievable. They stuck to the plan. Um, they brought the energy for the whole 60 minutes that they needed to. Um, yeah, I mean, we may have lost on the scoreboard, but... I'm extremely proud of how hard they played that team. And the, the goalie tandem tonight, just just phenomenal. I know I like to ask about goalies, but tonight, I mean, they they really did shine. They played great. They had their work cut out for them. And um, you know, we told Anna, you know, if you're feeling like you need to come out and get a rest, like you let us know. And so, you know, we did very unusual that I've ever done before. Switched them out a couple times, but um, they they played great back there. Um, and he, they did everything that we could ask of them. I said this on the broadcast, a game like this and a weekend like this is really a, 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 a gut check or I should say a program check. You get to see where you're at and everything like that. You guys, that was only the fifth time in now 17 conference games that Amira has scored three goals or fewer. That's that's a pretty proud thing to hang on the mantle. Aside from the loss, that's that's a big reason to smile. It absolutely is. I mean, I know like I'm smiling even though we lost, but they just they executed everything that we talked about and they believed in each other and they believed in themselves and to see them compete like that against the number two team in the country um i'm pretty happy two more things one is i thought i mean we talk often about your your large group of freshmen i thought tonight they had their best collective effort agree completely they just they brought it they bought into the the game plan they bought into each other and again just so proud then the energy on the bench tonight was palpable was noticeable and i have to imagine as a player when you hear that when you have that long shift and you you know you're having a trouble getting it out of the zone you know still playing defense that's got to be hugely uplifting to have your teammates that into the game yes and that was one of our game plans was we needed to celebrate the little things we needed to celebrate blocking a shot we needed to celebrate getting a clear when we needed it we needed to celebrate shoulder checking to feel the pressure just those little things that make such a big difference and um you know we wanted to celebrate them like they were goals and uh that's what they did so it's contagious all right i lied i have two more things okay. one is you guys only had one penalty tonight, and I believe have now killed off 12 straight. That was the number one power play unit in the entire nation, and uh, you didn't allow a goal on that the one power play. Yeah, they, they really had to dig deep on that one because our, our PK unit was out there for quite a while um, in that zone, and but they stayed dialed in, and again, with the energy from the bench, I think definitely helped, and, and they grinded it out, stuck it out, and um, even though it was just one, again, to kill off the, the top unit in the country, great job by our team. All right, Coach, congrats on the good effort. Go get uh, another solid one tomorrow and try and sneak into the conference tournament. Thank you so much. For Coach Johnson, I'm Paul Taylor. This has been a GoMustangSports.com Minute.